Muslim terrorist revenge attack. That's what I'm talking about in this video. I was actually in Franklin when this happened and the terrorist that done it was Omar Khayyam. Um, he was convicted for being part of the fertilizer bomb plot, which a lot of you will probably remember because it was big news at the time. And the lad that got hot oiled was Mala Crudus from over Gateshead. And the reason why this happened was, which I've mentioned previously on the other videos, was when Diren Barrett, another Al-Qaeda terrorist, got hot oiled in Franklin, something that I witnessed. He got hot oil tipped over the back of his head off another lad um, for being a terrorist. And he got took off the wing, got put into hospital. And two weeks later, his friend, which was Omar Khayyam, didn't want to be on the wing any longer. He wanted to get back down to Belmosh where there was more terrorists because he must have felt singled out being the only terrorist left on the wing in Franklin. And he might have felt, and felt vulnerable. So this year, what he's done, he's decided to take a revenge attack for what happened to his friend. And he's went in the kitchen, put a pan of hot oil on and it must have been bubbling away for half an hour. And in the meanwhile, Mala was sitting at a table eating his, uh, just having his dinner with two of his friends, unbeknown to him, just tucking away into his scran and the terrorist has come up behind him as he's sitting eating and just tipped the full pan over his head. And I've seen him just after this, his head swelled up twice the size and the skin was just peeling off his head and his face, off his shoulders and everything. It was horrendous, horrendous attack, really bad. He got put in the showers, uh, put in a cold shower until obviously the paramedics arrived and he got took to hospital under armed guard and he was in hospital for two and a half weeks getting plastic surgery and um, getting treatment for his burns. But that was a, the Muslim terrorist revenge attack that happened. Um, but you can imagine just after that there was friction on the wing, there was tensions, the fucking whole jail was in uproar. Yeah, obviously, the, both of the terrorists, Diren Barrett and Omar Khayyam, got moved out of the prison for reasons that you can understand because it would have went off if they came back onto the wings. But um, yeah, I'll just leave that one short and sweet for that one, people. But um, keep liking and subscribe to the next videos, people. Take care.